Today, we'll be talking about an extremely young rapper that's stirring up a lot of controversy in the industry. Lil RT is the new nine-year-old rapper making big waves in the music scene. There's a ton of mystery surrounding the young artist's personal life, but we'll be taking a look at his rise and any information that's currently available about Lil RT. He's a young child from the west side of Atlanta, Georgia. There's not public information on his real name or the name of his guardians. At this point, everyone's doing a really good job of keeping his personal information private. Maybe they're scared of the repercussions that could come from promoting and supporting a young kid to rap about some pretty heavy topics. The young rapper's name is inspired by an infamous car that's often referenced throughout hip hop, the Dodge Charger, that has a model called the RT, which stands for road and track. The RT is pretty much the Hellcat's little brother, but the car is no joke. The young rapper went viral last month when he released the hit song, 60 Miles. Now, aside from the incredibly inappropriate topics that Lil RT's rapping about, in today's standards, this song would be considered pretty good. With the initial shock factor of RT being so young and the lyrics so dark, his music's guaranteed to strike a note with any listener. But for most people, it's not a good one. He's nine years old again, so he hasn't even gone through puberty. These are the kinds of lyrics that were coming out. And we covered this piece because it's not funny. It speaks to the corrosion of our culture. It the music video is currently sitting at over 3 million views on YouTube with the majority of the comments focusing on how young he is and on the negativity of his lyrics. A few weeks ago, the young rapper gained a lot more exposure after going on Kai Sinat's live stream. In case you've been living under a rock this past year, Kai is one of the biggest live streamers. He has over 8 million followers on Twitch and 4.9 million subscribers on YouTube. He's a smart man and knows that bringing a child on his show and co-signing him would stir up controversy and in return, bring in views. At one point during the stream, they had Lil RT freestyle. And this is what he said a few seconds into the verse. What? It seemed like everyone was shocked after the nine-year-old used the R word. It's sad that this is what comes to mind when the young artist thinks about rap and what it's supposed to sound like. But Kai Sinat wasn't the first person to collaborate with Lil RT. 29-year-old rapper Doughboy from Cleveland, Ohio, collaborated with the 9-year-old to make a song titled 60 Miles 2 to capitalize more on the recent success of 60 Miles. The Cleveland artist received a lot of backlash after the music video and song were released. Due to the subject matter that Lil RT raps about, Doughboy responded to the negative feedback on Twitter, saying that it's normal for kids to talk that way, and he also uploaded this clip defending himself. At the end of the day, he's nine years old. Think about, like, I don't know. I don't know if you're from or we from type shit, but where I'm from, goddamn, that's, that's a regular little nigga in the hood. After hearing the 29-year-old rapper's reasoning, people had even more opinions, many aligning with the view that he should be trying to steer the young artist in the right direction and show him a better way, instead of condoning the ignorance. But Lil RT seems to be gaining more and more traction. He just broke 200,000 followers on Instagram the week that this is being recorded. It's kind of odd how many grown men in the industry are supporting and co-signing Lil RT. Don't get me wrong, I wish this kid nothing but success and happiness in life, but the subject matter of his music and the lifestyle that he's leaning into and being pushed towards doesn't seem like a positive one, especially for someone who's only nine years old. To put it in perspective, most kids at that age are in third grade. To be honest, I think the line is pretty blurred when it comes to supporting versus taking advantage of a young child in this situation. While we still don't have a lot of information available about Lil RT's personal life, it seems like we will be able to learn more about the situation as the child continues to grow his career and blow up in the industry. I hope that Lil RT is able to tone down the negative content and language in his music. I'm not sure what that would take or who in his life would need to step in to offer that guidance. I think there's a huge opportunity for other artists to encourage him to take his career in a more positive direction. At the end of the day, I believe Lil RT is still a kid, and what he needs most are people in his circle that can be a good influence for him to look up to. What are your thoughts on this? I'd love to hear them, so let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more music-related content. Don't forget to take your vitamins, say your prayers, and have a great day.